Hello, and welcome to Fox Tech. In today's video, we're going to discuss why you might be having trouble changing your wallpaper on your iPhone. This is a common issue that can be frustrating, but I'll walk you through some steps to help you resolve it. Let's dive right in. First, if you have a dynamic island on your iPhone, the process for changing your wallpaper involves using Face ID. Start by pressing on your screen without showing your face. You should see a message above the time saying, unlock to edit. When you see this message, press and hold the screen again. The screen will prompt you to show your face. Keep holding your press while you show your face to the screen. Once Face ID recognizes you, the screen will unlock and you'll be able to change your wallpaper or screensaver. Next, you should check if the wallpaper setting is restricted on your device. Sometimes restrictions, also known as screen time settings, can limit certain functionalities, including the ability to change wallpapers. To check this, go to the Settings app, tap on Screen Time, then go to Content and Privacy Restrictions. If Content and Privacy Restrictions are enabled, make sure that changing the wallpaper is allowed. This might be the key to unlocking your ability to change the wallpaper. Another method that works for many people involves long pressing on the lock screen. While your phone is locked, press and hold on the lock screen and then use Face ID to unlock it. This method has worked for many users. Even though it might not permanently fix the issue, it's a manageable workaround. In some cases, the problem might actually occur in, in the notification center, not on the lock screen. If Face ID doesn't recognize your face, try pressing and holding on the lock screen and then either show your face or enter your password. This should open the wallpaper customization screen. Keep in mind that tapping and holding might not work immediately after unlocking the screen with Face ID. Now let's move on to some basic troubleshooting steps. Have you tried restarting your phone? I know it sounds obvious, but sometimes we jump into complex troubleshooting without attempting a simple restart, which can fix the issue 95% of the time. So before trying anything more complicated, give your phone a restart. If all else fails, consider updating your iOS to the latest version. Sometimes bugs and glitches in the operating system can cause issues like this. Updating to the latest iOS version can often resolve these problems as updates usually come with fixes and improvements. To summarize, start by ensuring you're using the correct method with Face ID, check your restrictions and screen time settings, try the lock screen press and hold method, and don't forget the good old restart. If none of these solutions work, updating your iOS might be the final step to solving the problem. Thank you for watching this tutorial on Fox Tech. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Peace.